what is Alicante all about? Let's find out! It is a city, but at the same time you feel like it's a bit of a village. People are very warm, welcoming. Well, actually, I love Spain. Spain has much more to offer. And I don't want to wait until I'm 70. I just want to do it now. I want to start my business here. It's a lot of emphasis on health. The food that people eat here is fresh, it's vibrant, it's alive. It makes them feel good. Oh, you can go to concerts, exhibitions. It's fantastic weather all year round. I mean, what is there not to like about Alicante, <laughs> basically? Alicante is the capital of the province of Alicante. It is also a historic Mediterranean port. With a population of over 330,000, it's the second largest Valencian city. We are in a beautiful Alicante, gorgeous city. What does Open Door do here? We help people to find houses. We help sellers to sell their house. I myself moved here a while ago. I'm also uh, helping people to realize their dream and move to, to Spain, and particularly Alicante or Alicante region. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, both uh, Alicante province, inland, sea style, south, near the beach, in the mountains. Why do you love the city? It has everything, I think. Um, it has beach, of course, uh, sun, uh, like many places at the beach do, but it also has a very nice atmosphere. So I really like it. It is a city, but at the same time you feel like it's a bit of a village. People are very warm, welcoming. From here, wherever you drive, you know, within 10 minutes drive, you're already in the mountains. If a person thinks to move down to Spain, how would you help them? In many ways, actually, because every person is different. We, of course, do have people that saved up some money and want to buy a second house, so we help them finding an apartment or a nice villa in the mountains or a nice beach, beach residence. But there are also people, a bit like myself, that say, well, actually, I love Spain. Spain has much more to offer, and I don't want to wait until I'm 70. I just want to do it now. I want to start my business here, and what can you do to help me? And that's really what I like, because we are also selling businesses, so I can then connect them to the business people You know, we are also in touch with. But also, it's helping them to find schools for their children, um, making them feel at ease in Spain. And also telling them that being in Spain is not just laying on the beach. Uh -huh. So I think it's important to integrate in the real Spain, if you also want to have your living here, of course. And we yeah. caught you on your busy day and you're very mobile with your office yes. in your hand. <laughs> Correct, yeah, this is my office. And we're also lucky to have a contract with the banks, so we are allowed to sell bank properties all over Spain. So basically, if someone would come tomorrow and say, it's nice to be in Alicante, but we're also looking for a place in Madrid, we can offer it to them. So for me, it's very important to be flexible. What I like about bank properties, you probably know that uh, Spanish economy has well, gone down a few years ago, um, which resulted in many houses to be empty and also being repossessed by banks. They want to sell, they don't really need to make a profit, they just want to have a fair price for that house. So what would be the price range of uh, properties you are selling? Uh, at this moment, the cheapest one is about 50,000 euros and the most expensive one is about half a million. I'm originally Dutch, but I have traveled all over the world, uh, lived in many countries as well. What would be the best place in the world for me to live? And I thought that would be Spain. And I think many people think the south of Spain is not green at all. I think it is. Just look for it and you're amazed sometimes. Is it easy, easy to uh, do business here in Spain? I could say yes, because <laughs> it's just also because I really like it. Uh, and I was also lucky to find very good collaboration with Spanish people from the start, because our company uh, is focusing on selling through auction, which is new in the Spanish market. So I had actually expected that Spanish would say, oh no, that's not for us, we don't want it. But actually the bank said, oh, we have a very good idea, we see that you're a professional company, so we want to work with you. There are definitely many opportunities for people to settle in Spain. Uh, well, for example, our company, we are expanding and we are actually looking for people willing to open new offices throughout Spain. So everyone who's interested, I would say, you know, let them come to us. If you're in 
looking for a culinary treat, Alicanta is the place to come to. The restaurants are abundant, the food is amazing, you can eat anything from Spanish tapas to Indian to Italian. If you would like to eat on the beach, not a problem, you can do it as well. Would you like to try vegetarian food in Alicante? That is possible too. Wonderful vegetarian restaurant in Alicante. Where are you girls in Alicante? Whereabouts are we? We're in, right in the centre of Alicante. 20 meters from La Esplanada. The food that we have is of course vegetarian, but we also have an offer of raw food, vegan food, gluten-free food. It's an international menu, so you'll find food from more different cultures. Alana, why would non-vegetarian be interested in your food? It's a lot of emphasis on health. The food that people eat here is fresh, it's vibrant, it's alive, it makes them feel good. So I think most people are sort of like willing to try that experience. We're always trying to be creative and innovative and offer something that people really haven't seen before. Always trying out new ingredients and new ways to combine things. Olga and I both have a background in vegetarian food, over 30 years each. And we decided to come to Alicante because we both love this city. It's a fantastic city. Why do you like it so much? It's, it has a very cosmopolitan feel. Okay, so it has everything that you need of a larger city, but at the same time, the essence is that of a, of a small village. And also, we're surrounded by mountains. We have the sea 50 meters away. It's fantastic weather all year round. I mean, what is there not to like about Alicante, <laughs> basically? All year long, huh? Yeah, yeah, it's great weather. I mean, here we are in winter. It's fantastic, yeah. Let's hear more about the town from one of the city's great residents, culture lover and a musician, Pepe Bornai. How is Alicante for you different in winter time than summer? Do you feel the difference as a person that lives here? Yes, and even the visitors are different. Yeah, it's a different kind of, of tourism. Tell me. Yeah, like more cultural. When you think about uh, Alicante and Costa Blanca, you mainly think about beach, good sun, holidays like that. But you can find nice buildings, the ambience, a rich cultural life. You can go to concerts, exhibitions, there's many new activities now. Tell us a little bit about what you do. Oh well, we have a music school here okay. in the city. Right. And then, you know, playing groups, jazz groups so mainly. You teach adults and children or? Yeah. So on every corner we've got something interesting in Alicante. What have we got here? You have the castle, then you have a very nice church built on, on a medieval mm -hmm. stratus, and then you have the contemporary art museum. Right. You know the Camino de Santiago, mm -hmm. it's from here okay. in Alicante, yeah, one of the roads. The old style tapas, restaurants, Spanish food and all that. And then you, you can find very nice new restaurants, design, new cuisine, which are, which are becoming quite famous. Most. So you can see how nice is the winter weather here. And this is the Rambla, you said? This is the Rambla. The Rambla is an old riverbed? Or? Yeah, it's oh. an old riverbed with, when, when it comes to rain, all the water goes to the, to the sea. Okay. It's very typical, La Rambla de Barcelona. Okay. You can see all over Spain. It's like a kind of a symbol of the city, this pavement. And it's, a, it's taken from a, from a beach, from another promenade in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Okay. It's a curiosity. Beautiful. You're involved into the music scene of Alicante, of course. Yeah. Concerts, the, festivals. Yeah, the thing, cinema festival. Okay. Which we have a section which is music for the música para la imagen. Uh -huh. is music for the mates. And then we make the jazz festival. The city lives 24 hours. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's a coast city. Yeah. So, and with this weather, what do you want? Let's see. Fantastic. Yeah. Very good. We hope you enjoyed the film and to find out more about other people and the towns of the Costa Blanca, tune into our website at apnocostablanca.com.